Hey everybody, so if you see my last video, we just received our pile of loot, which includes wave three of the Super 7 Ultimates. And we got them in the collector grade double box. So we're just gonna open up the boxes and check out the figures and see if the collector grade is all it says. See if these boxes are in main condition. We'll go ahead, I got April O'Neil here. Open it up first. logo the old school turtle logo and another plastic bag these always wrap so yeah it's pretty good condition so far i don't see anything wrong with this box with the sleeve however i'm gonna pull her out yeah yeah she's super cool Blue stripe April. Got the extra heads with the the head set on there. I love the Donatello on the Turtle Kong. That's super cool. Yeah, two shades of hair. Pretty much, yeah. You have the like the April, the first version of the April haircut, mm -hmm. and the second version. Now she even comes with a stand for her camera. That's super cool too. And then the peg in the back. The whole weapons rack. Yeah, so I didn't know the old the old weapons rack. See, look how it is. It looks just like the legs. I guess you could have made the tripod with the old April O'Neil's weapons rack. I've never. I don't know, I'm gonna try it. I have a couple. Yeah, it comes with this one Yeah, that's uh, four, four, three extra sets of hands in there. Briefcase, just like the OG April O'Neil 1988 figure. She has her pistol, her microphone. Yeah, it's awesome. Super cool. But yeah, I love the boxes on these. pretty dope. Comes with all his original parts, just like the original figure from the 90s. Or was he 89? I think Metalhead was 89. That's the finger, the little finger opener. That's pretty cool. I forget what's, what it's called. <laughs> from the cartoon. Weapons rack in the back. Extra hands. He has extra radar too, yeah. One must go in his hand and one in the backpack maybe. I wonder if one of the heads has the has the luminescent eyes, doesn't look like it. Could be that one. Does that look like clear plastic the eyes to you or is it painted? That could be clear. That's painted. Yeah. Could be. I don't know. Yeah, because the old figure the, the light shines through the top of his brain and then his eyes light up. So I don't know if they did that with this one, but it's just super cool. Maybe they just painted, look, made it look like that. Just yeah, that. probably. Yeah. Oh, his I'm neck's all looking. gold too. It's awesome. Super cool. I'm still if you thought I'm gonna open these or not. It's only got only got one of each, and they're pretty pretty sweet in their packaging. Oh, except for that. There we go. That might make me want to open it right there. Oh, right there. Oh my gosh. As pieces loose. I didn't even notice that. Mm. So that's going to bug me. See, as a collector grade, I mean, that's going to bug me as an inbox collector. So what do I do here? Do I buy another one and return this one? Probably will. <laughs> or do I buy another one and open it? Just open this one and buy another one. Who knows? Only time will tell. But there's Metal Hint. Super awesome. Love it. Love the 
boxes, love the sleeves, love everything about these. They're just super cool. Stiff on my feet. Looks like everything's intact on here. Gun chucks popping out a little bit there. Fairly. Yeah, he's super cool. Colors are super bright on him. He looks dope. Comes with the pizza box, with melted cheese on top. I don't know if that slice comes out, if it's stuck in there, but either way, it's super cool. Got the OG face and then the new face. Comes with the grappling hook. He didn't come with that originally, so that's awesome. Paint on his teeth. On his teeth? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, there's a little white paint missing on his teeth there. Uh, a little something on the weapon there. But it's cool that they're painted and it still comes with like the original weapons rack in the back. All the original color. Too. Oh, and the, um, oh, it comes with two sets of chucks. It comes with chain chucks. And then you can see them in there. It comes with like original chucks that are painted. And then it comes with the, the OG brown chucks on the rack. So that's super cool. Bell looks awesome. I still have yet to open up the Raph. I have two Raphaels. One to open and I still haven't opened up one. But yeah, Michelangelo, he's super cool. I like the original heads on him anyways. The extra facial expressions are really cool. God, I just super want to pop that in. It bugs me. So that's, uh, the boxes are nice. Yeah, but... What's in the back? Two out of two. Something popping out. But I haven't even showed the backs. Yeah, the mm -hmm. backs have... They have like a bio, like a bio card. Cool little turtle logo there. I think the bad guys probably have a foot. We'll see it in the next one. Graffiti. That's super good. Yeah. yeah, well, that's awesome. I'm happy with that too. It's cool. Boom, Michael. In. Changing colors to the purple foot. It's rock steady. Get the sleeve off of here. That's super cool. Purple with the turtle logo. It is rock steady. Boom, he's gigantic. Yeah, he's got some weight to him too. He's super cool. Yeah, I still want to open up him and be bottom them together. They're massive. Yeah, like compared to the original figure, he's like three times the size, I'd say. So, there's OG gun with a shield. Comes with three grenades. Some extra fists in there. And the OG weapons rack with the knife and the gun and another shield. Painted knife, yeah, just the detail on his face, it's super nice. Yeah, actually, the paint's pretty good on him too. Yeah, he's super cool. Looks like in the box, his arm's a little tweak though in the box. Yeah. That's kind of bugs me too. It's just how his elbow's not locked into place where it's supposed to be. Just displaying that in the box as a clay figure. Like, ah. Yeah, it should be, his elbow should be pushed in there. Oh. Quality care, man. I swear, sometimes it's just, I don't know if it's just me with OCD, but it could be a little better. The packaging and stuff. But that's super cool. Rock steady, yeah. So it's wave three. Let's see the back. Oh, there's a the foot. Yeah, and there's the foot for the bad guys. Rocksteady, Mutant GI, Mauler, and Shredder's number one thug. Is he? I thought Bebop was number one. Anyways. Yeah, super cool. So that's Wave 3, Super 7, Ultimates, TMNT. Hope to get Wave 5 and 6 in soon.